Good morning, Don Lane, Fraser Valley News, your morning news update for this Thursday, October the 10th. We are expecting later today the uh, judge's ruling in a judge-only trial for Oscar Arfman. He is the man who two years ago was accused of murdering Abbotsford Constable John Davidson. We are expecting a verdict today. Uh, we will be watching that. Now, if it is first-degree murder, that's an automatic 25-year sentence before you are eligible for parole. Also, last night, uh, Chilliwack School Board had an emergency meeting on do they or do they not send a memo, a letter, to City Council re the portal shelter and being very close to th two schools in general and a third school not that far away. Uh, it was defeated, the argument being the portal was not the problem, it was crime and homelessness in general that is a concern. The portal has been used to get people off the street. That has prompted heated social media debate, uh, and including a few comments on FraserValleyNewsNetwork.com, so we will be following that story. Perfectly Petty, a Tom Petty uh, tribute that has been getting rave reviews, is coming to Chilliwack. That's Friday, November the 22nd. Uh, Surrey Cares Grant Ceremony, uh, the list of recipients were mentioned uh, in the legislature this past week by MLA for Surrey South, <coughs> excuse me, Stephanie Cadjo. And uh, FBN Fraser Valley News was part of that. I had the privilege of being MC for those awards just a few weeks ago. Uh, also, Trinity Western, their hockey program, which will start up next year, is already signing up uh, some of their first women's hockey players. And uh, Trinity Western will be making a, a little more of a splash when it comes to university sports. So we'll hear more from them in the weeks and months ahead. Also, and it's that time of the year with Thanksgiving coming up this long weekend, Turkey safety. Make sure you cook it thoroughly. Uh, by the way, flu shots are available next week. Anything we need to know, let us know. FVN at Shaw.ca. FVN at Shaw.ca. It's a cool one, but uh, we should be shooting for 17 degrees later today. Don Lane, Fraser Valley News.